Hello! Welcome to Cyber Safe with CC Nerd, where I tell stories and help you understand cyber hygiene best practices in the most relatable way possible. My name is Confidence Stavely, aka CC Nerd. In today's video, I'll be discussing five things you must do immediately if your phone is stolen. If you haven't already subscribed to this channel, please click the subscribe button right now for more videos like this. Now let me share a very personal story. Some years back, my family and I were robbed and the thieves scattered away with our valuables, including all our phones. And I was in so much shock because this was the first time this was ever happening to me. And I couldn't gather myself or put myself together to take the necessary actions to protect myself from fraud. Because I just thought to myself, well, this guy just want to steal the phone and maybe sell it to someone else in the black market at some really small amount of money guys it will shock you they had more on their plates on their agenda they definitely wanted more than that so what happened was um the next day i just noticed some strange activity on my um my personal email that indicated that someone was trying to gain access guys my whole feeling transitioned from shock and helplessness to quickly wanting to take action to salvage the situation and protect myself because Although it didn't end in me losing money, it could have ended in that. And that is exactly why I made this video, to help you, because you might not just be as lucky as I was, and to help you understand what to do immediately your phone is stolen from you, or if you're robbed or anything like what I experienced. Now here are my five simple tips. One, first and foremost, before this ever gets to happen to you, put a password or biometric screen lock on your phone to make it harder for these thieves to get access to the information on your phone because that could be personal information they could use to wreak more havoc two put a lock on your sim card because your when your phone is stolen the person has access physically to your sim card and can take your sim card out and of course insert into a new device and begin to um, make transactions or have access to your your accounts your social media accounts or even other information about you so it's important that you put a sim lock on your sim card so they don't have access um, to your to uh, your phone number and of course get to do more the, the, the there's a link on the screen right now to show you how to do that on your phone if you have a nigerian sim now tip three is if you use an iphone it's a very smart thing to do if you wipe your device remotely immediately it's stolen you might not have so much of a chance to do that but if you can put yourself together this is a very smart thing to do Tip four is to dial your bank's USSD short code using any mobile phone within your reach to block your bank account immediately. Now, dial the corresponding short code for your bank. Um, you can find all of the short codes in the caption and of course on the link in the screen right now. If you find the short code for your bank, dial it as quickly as possible with any phone within your reach to be able to block your bank account. I will put together those for the Nigerian banks. Now, five and very important tip if you can't find the, the short code in this video, of course, and if you're viewing this from any other part of the world apart from Nigeria, it's very smart to call your bank. Call your bank immediately. Remember, a stitch in time saves nine. Take action immediately, your banking enabled phone is stolen. Make you no go for Magao.